So one of the scientists aboard. Oh, what's that? Oh, it looks like we have an eel there. Can we maybe zoom in just a little bit on that? Or a lot of bit. Zoom in, Dave. That looks cool. I was like, is that a snake? Yeah, it's a big eel. <laughs> so like yeah. a moray eel or something? It does look like a moray. It looks like a gymnothorax species. Dang, that's cool. That's very cool. Up here a little shallower, so more similar to the ones that we see up in the shallow coral reefs. And uh, of course, they always look a little scary because they have their mouths open, but that's just how they pass water over their gills, so. Okay, but it's still kind of aggressive. Well, and they do have these really crazy pharyngeal jaws. So they have a second set of jaws inside of their mouth. If you think about the movie Aliens, yeah. the gray eels have those. It's kind of like a double jaws. Wow. Oh, scary. my God. That's supreme focus, Dave. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> you are a beautiful eel. It does seem lost, though. What's it doing here? I, um, you know, I don't think it's lost. I think it's. It's kind of like an ambush predator, right? Yeah. You sometimes see them out, um, moving around. He's not too far from a crevice. He's probably out looking for a meal, or maybe he was interested in our lights. Yeah, because those eyes are not like deep sea eyes. Yeah. Well, keep in mind that light does penetrate here down to about 300 meters. Um, really? The waters are really clear. Wow. Not quite this bright, though. Yeah, <laughs> not this bright. 